What's up, everybody? It's me, your boy, Spirit Aranus. Metroid Samus Returns came out. I, I'm going to uni tomorrow. I gotta do this quick. This is the last video that's gonna be filmed in here. Uh, I'm ill. It's raining. Let's do this. <laughs> it's pretty self explanatory. It's Metroid Samus Returns. I've been excited about this game ever since E3. Uh, oh, I'm gonna fix my hair. It is not looking great. I have to do this so flipping quickly. Just about managed to find like a spare <laughs> spare moment in the middle of packing. Just like, right, film this. Okay, this is the fancy like special edition that European people got because Nintendo apparently likes us now. Uh, I'm failing to believe that still, but you know, it swings and roundabouts as it were. So in this, we get a load of really cool stuff basically. And I'm gonna stop beating around the bush. There's the front of the box. There's the back, there's a top, there's a bottom information, I don't know. It feels really nice, it's a nice box, I like it, it looks very pretty. Let's go, let's open it. Oh, open, right off the bat. The efficiency you've never seen in a Spirit Unboxes before, because this package is just so easy. Right off the top we got a thing with a Metroid logo on it, pretty nice, I like it. Ooh, what's inside? Bada oh, that's pretty. That is... Flipping gorgeous. That's that's gold. That's the Metroid logo. Ho, oh, that's nice. That's that's very nice. Oh, we got more images on top. Samus in a pose and Metroid. And I must say, the CG renders from Samus Returns they did are beautiful. I want more of them. I want, want more of them yesterday. Like more of that, please. Chrome 4 better look half as good as those. We've got we got a bag. We got a bag. It jingles, of course. Okay, hello. That is a morph ball. That is a key ring. My keys are about to get even more badass than they already are. For comparison, here's a morph ball that I got from, like, ow! Silent <laughs> Spirit unboxes if I don't drop something. That's a morph ball I got from, like, a Samus figure. This is the keychain. <laughs> it rolled off. It's beautiful. I'm gonna find my keys immediately. Where are my keys? Don't know where I put my keys. I found my keys. Nobody found it. It's kind of beat up looking, but I got a Street Fighter keychain on there. It looks like we're about to take a bit of a step up. If I can figure out key rings. Oh gosh. Oh, we got it. We got it, boys. No, we don't. Oh, well, things are just just falling apart right now. Flippin' did it. You didn't think I could, did you? But no. Now I have more put on my keys. I could not be happier. <laughs> well, inside we have the art book. The entire reason why I got excited about this Legacy Edition, I love concept art and art books. I cannot wait to look through this. I opened it. Ba-bam. This is the sort of stuff we're getting into. Oh, that's pretty. I don't have time to look at this, but here's another one. Ba-bam. <laughs> Let's carry on. I don't know what this is. It's the download code for Metroid 2. That's that's great. I already got Metroid 2 on 3DS a long time ago. So if anyone wants a code for Metroid 2, uh, I'm giving one out. First channel giveaway. Because we're that popular. I think it might only work if you're in the UK though, so I will check that and then I will link a giveaway or something. I'll figure out how to do that and then I'll do that. I'm gonna be generous. Yeah! Alright, there's two more things in this box. Oh, steelbook. I've never had a steelbook before. This is quite exciting. It's shaped like a Game Boy cartridge, like it was for Metroid 2. There's no game inside there. Tragic. That's literally all we paid for the whole 60 quid. It was just for all these Metroid themed accessories, but not the game itself. Honestly, I don't know what I was thinking. It's not true, obviously. But that is very nice. I like that. I like that a lot. Uh, oh, there's another thing. No, that's just cardboard. That's just cardboard from inside the box. Ugh. Oh gosh, it's all going wrong. Oh, yeah, don't, don't, don't look at that. Don't look at that. We also have a CD from the series. It's got it's got tracks on it. What? What did I do with the game? Oh wait, no, I threw it over there, didn't I? The game. Uh, I don't know how to tell you guys, but this is this looks like it's in in German. No, it's not. It's in European, meaning it's it's very little text, <laughs> but they just put on all the languages just to be sure. I cannot wait to play this. I'm not going to play it right now because I don't have time, but if you want to know what's in the Legacy Edition, it's that. Metroid's back, I'm ecstatic, and the next time you see me, I won't be here. I'll be at 
a different room and I will probably maybe cut to that now or you'll see it in a different video so uh, one last time this is from this room this has been Spiro Randomness uh, I hope you have an amazing day see you next video bye that's the quickest I've ever done a video in my entire life oh my word oh hi I didn't see you there <laughs> hey everyone it's it's your boy it's Spirit of Randomness back at it again with the update videos or whatever this is, I don't know what I'm doing with this, but I've I've moved into uni now. I have a whole new house, not to myself. Uh, I have other people living here as well. They're cool. I keep staying up playing Smash until like 11 o'clock. It's it's great fun. But yeah, just a couple of things to go over. What you just saw was the um, the Sandwich Returns unboxing that I did about four weeks ago now, like a good month ago. Uh, yeah, I've not been on top of things, mainly because I've just been spending so much like time and effort trying to get everything sorted here and uh, just in general sort my life out a little bit. Like get used to the whole being in a whole other county halfway up the country sort of deal, you know, that's like flip new places, new things they have to do. I have to cook now, it's great fun, but it's a lot more thinking than I was initially intending. And yeah, so that's why this hasn't come out for a month. And also why uh, everything's just sort of been up in the air with me. I've not been posting a lot on social media about where I am and what I've been doing. Um, but that's why I'm just, it's more because I'm trying to just get into the flow of doing uni now, because that is <laughs> ostensibly what I'm doing. So, uh, in terms of what to expect for future content, don't hold your breath. <laughs> Again, I know it's the problems of following me on YouTube, but I don't do this as a job at all. This has always been more of a hobby, and if I have time to do it, I will, but more often than not, I don't. So. I think content's just going to continue to act like that more than anything. Live streams I do want to do more of, because they are really fun. And the internet is more stable here, but whether or not I'm actually going to be able to do that, or have the time to do that, is another thing or entirely, I don't know, is the thing. Uh, I've already just gotten started with uni, I'm in my third week of study, and it's already a bit, whoa, it's, it's a lot, it's a lot. I, I really can't promise anything, and it sucks that I can't, and I hate that I can't, but really, it's just it's just the way things are at the minute. Hopefully, hopefully I have time to make a couple of videos, because there's a lot of things I want to do. But again, it's, it's the study has to come first, in this case. Thinking about it, is, as long as I organise my time right, I should be able to still do stuff like them to fight in words and live streams if I just leave the time for it. Which I think I should have, but... Um, Beyond that, this is just another video of me saying, when's new videos coming? I don't know, sorry. <laughs> so, yeah, this is just how it is, I guess. In other news, Zelda Universe have done a, are doing a sort of redub of Hyrule Warriors, so they're just getting in a load of people from across the internet to voice characters and dub the entire game over. I've auditioned for that, I haven't heard back from anyone yet about it, because auditions only just closed, but hopefully I made it in. Uh, you might be hearing your boy do Girahim, or Ganondorf, or Volga, I don't know, those are the guys I auditioned for. Uh, so yeah, hopefully that works out alright. Probably won't, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. Samus Returns is amazing, you all should pick it up, it's great, if you've got a 3DS please get it. It's so good, and makes me very optimistic for the future of my favourite franchise. Oh yeah, Marvelous Capcom Infinite. I have some things I need to say about that at some point, hopefully I'll have the time to do so, expect nothing from me. But if you're going to expect anything, expect like a dressing gown rundown on that. Remember when that was a thing? I don't know, I don't know if I'll actually even be able to film like that, I might just have to do all audio or record like this, purely because I don't have a tripod anymore. I am balancing this camera on the Elgato box, Seasons 1 and 2 of The Flash, and Metroid Samus Returns Legacy Edition box. So yeah, it's a bit precarious. Uh, other than that though, uh, I need to 
get on with stuff. So, um, yeah, hope you've been enjoying the janky ass animations, because that might just be my channel from now on, is me learning how to animate with 3ds Max, which is what I need to do right now. So, I'm going to say my goodbyes, hopefully I'll see you guys again soon, and uh, yeah, just have a brilliant day. Your boy's still alive, he's not died yet. From uni. Peace. I, I don't know how to end these videos. Ever.